Camp 28 has stood the test of time, opening back in the town's early logging days. We're really excited about this place in particular just because of its, its history. Hundreds of pictures, a lot of history in this building. Now reopening its doors for a new chapter. Dan actually relocated to the area and um, he'll tell you the story over and over how he uh, was looking for some fish fry in an old fashioned. I had a craving for old fashions and fish fry and I couldn't find that in the area together so I, I said that's unacceptable. Saw this place and said why don't we buy it. I got laughed at for the next month. So here, here we are. are. Chef Dan is no stranger in the kitchen. Going to culinary school, moving to London, coming back and then you know opening up a restaurant in Rhinelander and then managing a couple of other restaurants in Rhinelander and now I'm here. Bringing what he calls Supper Club 2.0 to Rib Lake. Just a little bit of extra care and love into each dish and you know just bringing it up out of you know decades past. The new general manager is also an artist, bringing her mix of talents to the project. Our excitement is shown through our pictures and our photos we've been posting along the way and just everything about this place is exciting to me. It isn't just the Reshes and their team with big dreams here at Camp 28. In a town just under a thousand, a few smiling faces reopening a familiar favorite, that's pretty big news. We have put in a lot of hard effort to try to make this right and make, um, make a splash. We're excited. We're excited to serve um, and to be a part of the community. Updated hotel rooms, great food and drinks, and that extra special something. I think it's mostly the people. All here in Rib Lake. Cooper Henkel, Newswatch 12.